Hi again, I'm Dr. Dan Gartenberg, sleep scientist, and I'm going to show you now how to connect sleep space with various wearables, including Oura Ring, um, BioStrap, um, it works with Garmin, it works with 8 Mattress, and we do this by connecting through your Apple Health app. Um, so when you wake up in the morning, um, here's an example of your output when we sync with the Aura Ring. Um, and so this is live data pulled from the Aura Ring. One thing that we can do is have sound disruptions in addition to the Aura data. Um, and this is uh, my sleep from the session um, that I started. This is heart rate data from the Aura. This is sleep-wake data from the Aura Ring. Um, there's some testing here. I wasn't actually awake for that. I, I wasn't trying to fall asleep here. I was just testing out. Um, I do this for, I, I try to compare Apple Watch to Aura Ring and make sure everything uh, uh, is synced and somewhat similar between the devices. Um, in addition to the Aura data, we also display sound in the room data. Um, and I think this is, indicates when some of the deep sleep stimulation sounds were played. Um, and then we take the Aura data and have this custom feedback um, based on the Aura data that's being collected. So how did I get this all to work? Um, it's a little bit confusing for some people and that's why we're making this video. So first and foremost, you have to make sure that your Apple Health is connected. Um, and we automatically prompt you to do this within the app, but um, this all works through this Apple Health icon um, native app here. And you click on that to, to see that you're connected. Um, you would click on your profile. That's me there from a while ago. And then you click on apps. Um, and you see all the crazy apps that I've tried. Um, you see sleep space right here and you can see your preferences which should automatically have been set um, if you went through this prompt. And so that has to be on in order for us to grab data from HealthKit. And then what you do is in the morning, um, you would open a, your Aura app first. So let me just pull that up here. There we are. So here you would open your sleep session and then you would pull up the Aura app um, and you can see here that same date um, August 18th um, and you can see this is the data from the Aura ring it, ha it captured another sleep cycle here and I'll actually edit my journey to represent that um, and you can see this heart rate data is going to be reflected in sleep spaces heart rate data as well I'm actually going to edit this to represent the session more accurately because I did get another cycle in. Um, and if we scroll down here, you'll see this heart rate data is being pulled from Aura Ring. But you have to make sure you sync Aura first, and sometimes you have to then open up the Health app too to make sure the data propagates. Once the data propagates to this Health app, we pull that data and then we import it into our system. The intention here is to make a piece of software that's going to work with every single wearable. Um, so if I'm just using my phone by my bedside one night, it'll work. If I'm using my Aura Ring, we'll pull that data and it'll work. If you're getting the high resolution tracking data with Apple Watch, it'll work with that system too. So hope this is helpful and hope you have a great night's sleep. Thanks.